What's up, you guys? My name is Mary, and with High Priestess Intuition, welcome to my subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free channel collective reading, cups inside you, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. Um, just saying, just saying. Okay, so I got a um, channel message in as I was meditating um, on your energy. Um, so we're just, I'm just on to do the reading. Just saying, just saying. So the channel message I received, it's a free general collective reading. Um, it's very important. Only take the messages to resonate and leave the rest. I just want to make that very abundantly clear, okay? Very, very, very abundantly clear. Okay. So the channel message I received was... Um, Someone's sister put a hers, I mean, I'm sorry, not a hers, I can't speak, a um, hex on your son, um, her teenage son. However, it's about to boomerang and backfire back onto their son. Their son is about to start receiving um, some severe, heavy, negative karma, mental health issues, is what I just heard. So you plug it in, however that resonates. That is so crazy. So you plug it in, how it resonates. So someone's sister, it could be your sister or someone you're connected to sister, but um, they put a hex on your son. So they're jealous as hell of you, basically. Jealous as hell of you and your son, apparently. And they put a hex on your son. So your sister, if this resonates for you, um, practices in dark arts. And I'm just, I'm being serious. And they've probably been doing it a hot-ass minute. Um, they're probably skilled in it. Like, super skilled in it. And I'm serious. I don't feel like, um, you know, just the, just started my energy. I feel like um, skilled. Um, but, I heard, but black magic always backfires. It always backfires either a little bit or a lot. In this case, it sounds like a lot. Uh, because they're jealous of you and they're jealous of your son, obviously. But... Um, they basically, it's about to boomerang back energetically, it sounds like, onto their son, their son. And I heard this, their son, your sister's son, is basically about to start having severe mental health issues. So, um, you plug it in how it resonates. Um, that's universal karma at its finest. It's really sad for the her son. It's, I, I mean, I care for all children. All children, period. I don't care if they're my child or not my child. But your sister shouldn't have been messing with, one, messing with dark arts, and two, um, she should have left your son alone, and you alone. But she chose not to. Um, so now this is her negative, heavy karma. It's really um, sad. I shuffled, I got change on the bottom of the deck, 555 energy, so there's about to be changes in the mental health of her son, your sister's son. Um, this is terrible. It is about to piss her off in a huge, huge way, but it cannot be hidden. And it will not be hidden. Many shocking series of shame events will occur soon and quickly with this. Okay, wow. Heard it's about to piss her off in a huge way. So it's about to piss your sister off in a huge way. She obviously doesn't want her son to have mental health issues, but she will put a hex on your son in a New York minute. She probably put a hex on your son to give him mental health issues is my presumptive logic and reasoning guess on this. Because you don't put hexes and curses on people unless you wish ill upon them. And in this case, she was wish wishing ill upon your own, like a child. Like, I'm feeling minor energy, 18 or below. Her teenage son, uh, your teenage son. So your son is a teenager. So she put a hex on your teenager, basically. Um, so he has to be a minor, is what I'm saying. But... Um, there's about to be huge changes here. It sounds like in her son's mental health soon. So 555 change energy in her son's mental health because she did this shit. She started this shit with the black magic and now it's energetically boomeranging back onto her in the universe in the form of her son's mental health. Um, I heard it's about not to be uh, hidden. Uh, it's about to be, it sounds like very public, very soon, very quickly. Many shocking series of shame events are about to occur with this situation. So something is going to occur with his mental health in some shape, form, or fashion in public is what I'm presuming. 
Um, it might be at school. He might go to a public school. He might go to a private school, or it might happen in public. Um, there might be some kind of emotional outburst or, or something um, that transpires. I'm feeling in a public space, or it could be uh, maybe at a counseling session or or um, something that causes him to go to counseling, possibly. I mean, I didn't hear any of that, but possibly. Uh, but some kind of change, it sounds like publicly. Um, this, um, it sounds like many shocking series of chain events. So it's not one thing. It sounds like it's going to be many things um, that's going to um, create this change in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, let me see if I hear anything else. This child is severely depressed, and they will keep being severely depressed, and other severe mental health issues. Not around good fi family dynamics. Oh my God, this is terrible. This is terrible. This is terrible. Okay, so I heard the child is severely depressed, and they will continue to be severely depressed. Um, they're not around a good family dynamic um, in their home life, basically. Um, so it's creating severe depression. Um, I don't feel, you know, baby depression. I feel it might be like major depression energy here. Um, and I heard it's going to continue to be. Um, and, you know, the thing is, is if you're around a bad dynamic, right, family-wise, and it's not a happy, loving, stable home life, it's going to continue. Um, if you don't do something about it and make changes there, they're going to, it's like stagnant energy. They're going to continue to be majorly depressed if you don't make positive changes to change it. And that's just the truth. Um, whoever this resonates for, it's your sister's son. Um, I didn't hear age on him. I didn't hear age. You have to plug this person in while it resonates in your own life. Um, and I heard other severe mental health issues coming um too so he he might already have them and they're hidden and they come very public in a public space or public setting or someone in the public starts noticing these changes um however that re resonates in a crazy series of chain of events is what i'm presuming here so change energy for sure for sure um man it's your sister's son if this resonates for you spirit messages you have reflected I heard he's going to piss your sister off in a huge way. Yeah. Oh, my God. You cannot make this crack up even if you wanted to. We've got magic on the bottom of the deck. Number 25 could be a very significant number in one's life. Number 25, it could be a possible age of years, somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible date of birth number, possible green card number, possible um, uh, lottery um, jersey number, number 25, magic. She should have never put a, car, a hex on your son. She doesn't believe black magic backfires, but she's about to get a huge dose of reality soon. Okay, I heard she should have never put a hex on your son. However, she's about to get a huge dose of reality soon. I heard she doesn't believe the black magic backfires. So your sister doesn't believe black budget backfires, but basically she's about to believe it when she sees it manifest in her own son soon in the form of mental health issues. Um, this is sad. This is so sad. So in this case, it's your sister putting black magic all over the universe and definitely in a form of a hex on your son for sure. She might have put hexes on you in the past. I didn't hear any of that. She might have though, um, but definitely on your son. And now it's about to backfire on her own son and um, she's about to be pissed. So, this is use of black magic, dark arts, definitely hex energy of your sister onto your son. Um, if this resonates for you or you feel it does, let me see if I hear anything else.
Someone in the public eye is about to notice severe issues with your sister's son very soon. They're going to create many series of chain of events. It's going to piss your sister off in a huge way. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Wow. I heard someone in the public eye is about to notice severe issues with uh, your sister's son soon. Um, and it's going to create many series of chain of events, and it's going to piss your sister off in a huge way. So you plug it in how that resonates if you feel that resonates for you. Um, but your sister is a huge current black magic doer or former black magic doer. Um, usually people that are into dark arts, usually, you know, like, they don't go back. Uh, I mean, some reform themselves, some don't, but some of them don't. I feel she's a loyal black magic doer. Uh, for some, I feel they do it in secret, um, and I'm serious, but I didn't hear any of that, but possibly. But you plug it in, how it resonates. All right, I love you guys so much. Everybody made wonderful choices, and namaste.